Hi, good morning, Jacinda. I don't know what time of day it is with you. Kia ora, I should say. How are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. It's about, it's about nine o'clock at night here. Thank you very much for taking the call. Jacinda, I just want to say this is a, this is a big moment for, for the UK and uh, for our partnership with, with New Zealand. And we're absolutely thrilled that we seem to have driven for the line. Uh, we've scrummed down, we've packed tight, and uh, we've, together we've got the ball over the line. And um, we've, we have a, uh, a deal. And I think it's a great deal. I think it means that uh, we will be able to uh, have the benefit of our wonderful New Zealand products uh, even more cheaply than, than before. We've got uh, from Sauvignon Blanc uh, to Manuka honey and, 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 and kiwi fruit and, uh, and, and all sorts of other, other benefits. So I think it's a, it's a, a, a good deal for, for both of us. Our trade is already worth about 2.3 billion pounds and I, I wouldn't care to speculate by quite how much this deal will <laughs> augment that trade, but I think it will be uh, it will be considerable. It's part of our of our vision uh, in the UK, as you know, Jacinda, to to deepen our ties with the the Indo Pacific region, particularly with New Zealand. Our, our whole uh, Indo Pacific tilt is is in your direction, and we see this deal as a as a big big part of that. So thank you very much to you and and all your team for all your efforts. Thank you, um, Prime Minister. And uh, look, I, I, I loved your, your use of rugby metaphors, but if we were going to continue that on, then naturally it would, it would conclude with the All Blacks winning. And I know that New Zealand feels that way with this free trade agreement, but it's actually, it's good for both of us as it happens. It's good for our relationship, which is long-standing, which is unique, which has always included our, uh, our people-to-people uh, exchange being incredibly important to us but also our, our trading relationship being incredibly important to both of us as well. And this is an extension of that. To reach an agreement in principle uh, around such a high quality uh, agreement that is really based on the values that I know we both hold dear, that is um, an inclusive agreement and that really elevates those things that we've been both been prioritising uh, as part of a trade agreement is, is critical for us and really a moment to celebrate. You know, there's four things that stand out for me. First is the fact that it removes all tariffs and tackles barriers that had previously limited um, trade uh, and opportunities between both countries. The second, it's reinforcing our joint commitment to climate action. And you can see that really embedded in this, uh, in this agreement and our commitment to improving the environment of, of both our nations and indeed the world. The third for us, the inclusion of an Indigenous chapter, I think really speaks to the unique the unique history that we have and is an acknowledgement of that. And the fourth for me is is the, uh, concluding on matters that relate to our people to people exchange, because again, that's what makes uh, our relationship unique. And it's so much a part of uh, who we are as a nation, the people to people links that we have with you. So I believe this is an agreement that we can both be rightly um, proud of. Unlike a rugby match, I think we can literally both come off the field feeling like winners in this occasion. Uh, and I do want to join with you in thanking everyone who's been involved in concluding this agreement uh, and look forward to both countries reaping the benefit of it. Thanks very much, Jacinda.